Hi, I'm Kim McDonald, and I'm here for another night of New World Order news um, for March 15th, 2012. I watched a program earlier on tonight on TV, and it was one of the most sickening things I ever saw. A woman who drinks her own pee. She rubs it in her hair, on her face, um, but mainly drinks it and I don't even know what to think about that um, if any of you have an, any idea or thoughts on it leave me a comment about it um, to me it was quite sick and I never really realized there was people you know doing that maybe there's people out there that eat shit too I, I don't know but I imagine whatever you can think of, there's somebody that'll do it. Okay, tonight, um, I'll just uh, go ahead and start here. The mass media won't tell you that our police forces, schools, councils, hospitals, and even government are actually private corporations traded for profits of their shareholders. Our money is worthless and backed by nothing more than a promise and our belief in that promise. The people of the lands known as England, Wales, and Scotland are coming together as one and realizing what they have always known. We don't need a government and we don't need them always you know telling us what to do um, be, and to tell us what is right and what is wrong um, we the people are it's just sick um, we are sick of the unaccountable corporate governments and have decided that now is the time to take peaceful lawful action to remove our consent to be governed. Based upon Article 61 of the Magna Carta Lawful Rebellion. Um, okay, if, if you have time, try and uh, use YouTube or Google to search some of these words. Um, and if you can, look them up under law. You'll be quite shocked what they really mean. The word person, the word citizen, corporation, and statue. Also, summons and the word must. They all are things you never thought that in our world of law. Um, also, look on YouTube or Google for the meaning of illusion, legal fiction, Maritime Admiralty Law, also fluoride, also known as rat poison, and search the word harp, H-A-A-R-P. Um, yeah, the top three cities controlling the world, Washington, D.C., has the military control, London, England, they control the monetary system, and Vatican City has the spiritual control involving one billion followers. All three cities have their own laws that control the world, military, money, and spirituality. Um, search and look under AIDS and HIV cures. Um, as of 2011, this uh, you can type this number into Google, 5-67-6977. AIDS patented drug never released to people. Um, yeah, it's it's pretty sick. Um, all that the IRS, CIA, FBI. Uh, FCC and NASA 
are and never were part of the U.S. government. Look it up. They are not U.S. agencies despite your beliefs and what you have been told. Global warming is not caused by us doing things wrong. It is, however, the biggest tax scam of all time with carbon tax. All planets in our solar system go through a global warming every once, every so many years. Um, and yet they're trying to tell us it's us that's causing this so they can raise all their tax monies. Fuck them. I'm sick and tired of all this crap. Um, you know, the control of media and the music industry, TV, subliminal messages, lists, mind programming, um, Google, Project Paperclip, and Project Monarch. Um, everyone needs to see these facts for themselves. Um, whatever happened to, you know, for the people, by the people, well, it got flushed years ago, everyone. Wake up, have a look, and and you'll see, you'll be scared like I am and most other people I know are of what's happening to our world right now. A world prison is what we're going to end up with. Um... You know, we are not the people we should be, but we believe too much what the puppet president we have has to say about anything without saying it to him. Prove it. Fucking tell the truth, you fucking liar. Obama, if that's the name you're using today. It astonishes me to find that so many of our countrymen should be content to live with under a system which leads to the governors the power of taking them, the trial of jury in civil cases, freedom of religion, freedom of the press, freedom of commerce, the habeas corpus laws, and yoking them with a standing army. This is degenerate in the principles of liberty which I would not have expected for at least four centuries. Quote, Thomas Jefferson, 1788. Um, there has never been a golden age of liberty, and there never will be. People who value freedom will always have to defend it from those who claim the right to wield the power over others. Quote, David Bolt. Libertarian, Executive Vice President of the Cato Institute. Now, come on, people. From pissing to drinking your piss to goddamn um, telling us outright lies and then laughing about it. Believing that we all will believe our government. They are full of shit. You need to wake up. Go to these places on YouTube and Google. Type in things. You will be shocked. FEMA death camps. Bilderbergs with the Rothschilds. Illuminati. They're all coming out of the woodwork now. Now is the time we have to fight. You know, um, that's all I have to say tonight. God bless you all. Take care. Be careful. And always look over your shoulder. Good night.